Though aware is a national development organization, it responded in every national disaster by participating in relief and rehabilitation. It started from 1977 in participation with the Divisima Cyclone Relief until 2018 Kerala floods. Aware participated 15 times in cyclones, floods and earthquakes from Kerala to Uttarakashi. Kerala is known as God's own country. Legendary states the Kerala was reclaimed from sea by Lord Parshuram by his ex. It is highest literacy state with full of intellectuals. Adi Shankara spiritual revolutionary who revived Hinduism was born here. It is a state which defeated colonial power Dutch and chased them out of the country. Such great state faced greatest natural calamity of the century due to unprecedented rains which brought worst floods. It is the worst flood in Kerala after the great flood of 99 years that happened in 1924. Kerala received heavy monsoon rainfall 256% more than the usual rainfall in Kerala on the mid evening of August 8th the gates of the 35 of its 39 dams were forced to throw open instead of gradually releasing water knowing full well what was to come officials and experts have said the floods in kerala which has 44 rivers flowing through it would not have been so severe if authorities had gradually released water from at least 30 dams residents were forced to flee on important roads that happened to be engulfed in flood water and landslides all 14 districts of the state were placed on red alert One sixth of the total population of Kerala had been directly affected by the floods. Over 483 people died and 15 are missing. At least a million people were evacuated. 15 lakh 19,500 crores property got damaged. 10 lakhs na 28073 people were in relief camps 30000 crores was total loss for the small state it was jalapralayam in god's own country water deluge due to nature's fury and man made disastrous Kerala flood operation is one of the largest rescue operations. 40 helicopters, 31 aircrafts, 182 teams for rescue, 18 medical teams of defense forces, 58 teams of NDRF and 7 companies of Central Armed Police Forces, State Fire Brigade were pressed into service along with over 500 boats. and necessary rescue equipments the fishermen from across kerala were engaged in the flood rescue missions a total of 4537 from the fishermen community participated in the rescue operation with 669 fishing boats they managed to rescue more than 65000 people from various districts more than 8000 cattle calves and buffaloes 3297 goats and 47 dogs have died due to the flooding but people of kerala stood with courage and faced the destruction with minimum human loss different states of india contributed a sum of 212 crore rupees 
Telangana state alone contributed the biggest contribution of 25 crores. Relief operation took place for about 60 days. Reconstructions and rehabilitation may take more than a year. Aware is one which participated in all national calamities 18 times like floods, cyclones and the earthquakes and now again responded immediately with providing and distributing the relief materials like biscuits, medicines, sanitary napkins, steel plates, mats, bed sheets, saris, dhotis, t-shirts, towels, food materials and cattle field about 2000 families were helped. Suresh Babu executive director AWARE took lead with volunteers from Chandranagar housing colony and 4GB foundation in Palakkad in distributing the relief materials in areas like Manakkapadi, Vavakkad, Karimpadam, Purappilai Kavu, Tattampadi, Panad, Adukkalachira, Paravur, all at Karimalur area of Ernakulam district, Kenal Cheri at Chalakudi Trishur district, Karimpa Manakkad, CS Puram, all are in Palakkad district, Cattle Feed Distribution, Champakulam, Kuttanad area at Alappuzha district. Whole of the relief material was collected at Hyderabad from residents of Maple Township Community, Party Boys HGA, Golden Eagle HGA under the leadership of Abhishek Kankanala. Contributions were also received from AWARE head of its staff, Dr. Katta Narsimha Reddy and AWARE team with Lakshmi, Samiksha, Himabindu, Vasundra, Venkat Reddy, Varun, Manzur Ahmad, Durga Prasad, Y Venkat Reddy, Yesu Prabhu, Sudhakar, Samilata, Manager Srinivas, Narsimha Murthy, Rama Rao, Renuka, Manjula, Padma and Nageshwar Rao. Also contributions were received from Jawaharlal Nehru Architecture and Fine Arts, Prof. Dr. Kavita Duryani Rao, Sagar Asia Private Limited, Sparkles Kinder Castle, Mahatma Gandhi Institute of Technology, Aware College of Nursing and MLT, and Shloka International School. Aware Head Office contributed one week salary, numerous individual and organizations contributed to Aware. Kerala floods, unusual, unexpected, unprecedented, has human error, negligence, indifference. Whole country was shocked. Environmental experts cautioned Kerala its forthcoming disastrous. It was not taken serious. Back in 2011, the Gadgil community put together a bunch of recommendations to the central government about ecologically fragile regions in the Western Ghats, especially Kerala. Many other causes, deforestation, quarrying, mining, illegal repurposing of forests and high-rise building constructions, wetlands and lakes that acted as natural safeguards against floods have disappeared because of rampant urbanization and construction of infrastructure. They were man-made, uncontrollable factors that the state chose to brush aside. The flooding has definitely brought to light the existence of illegal stone quarries or a large number of unauthorized constructions on river beds. Professor Madhav Gadgil said, in this sense, it is definitely a man-made calamity where intense rainfall and human intervention have made it a serious disaster. Will Kerala learn a lesson? Will India learn from Kerala experience? Time alone will tell. Protect Mother Earth for future generation. Promote wealth and money for future disasters. Mahatma Gandhi said, the world has enough for everyone's need but not enough for everyone's greed.